Good evening, this is Keith All, and welcome to my channel. Uh, today we're going to learn how we can create a split screen before and after effect in Photoshop. So on the screen you see this uh, image of this uh, beautiful model, and I created an effect. Was, in other words, I added some noise on one side, and the other side is the original image. So let's see how we could do this. Let's go over here. I have the original image here. What I want to do is I want to duplicate this image. I'm going to press Control J as a shortcut on a PC. Okay, I'm going to hide this copy. And we're going to work momentarily just on our original layer. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create some noise on this image. So I go to Filter. Blur, or not blur, noise, and then add some noise. And I'm just going to leave what the options I had the last time I created this. So I'm going to click OK. So what this is uh, uh, doing is um, it just adds the effect to the image that I want to create. Now let's go up, up to the top layer. Let's show this layer again. And now we're going to create like a split screen. So we see the before and after effect. So I'm going to keep this selected. I'm going to create a layer mask on this layer. Oh, before I do that, I'm going to create a selection first. So I'm going to use the rectangular mark T tool. I'm going to have a ruler here so it um, creates uh, half the image I'm going to draw a selection over to half the image okay now I want to do is I want to create a layer mask based upon this selection so I come over here and correct create layer mask let's get rid of the ruler by pressing control H on a PC and now you can see there's a before and after effect. So the before is the original image. The after effect is what I created with the noise. So let's see how this is actually done. So once you create a layer mask on a particular layer, in this case, I created a layer mask using a selection. So what it does is, as you can see here on the right in the layers panel, the mask thumbnail has a white and black um, section to it. Remember, when you use a layer mask and there's white and black, black will uh, uh, hide or basically conceal, and the white will reveal. So when uh, so on this particular instance, the black on this particular layer, which was this top layer black will hide it so black will hide this this area of this image so when it does that it hides this this top layer and in turn when it hides the top layer in this section it reveals the layer below it so it uh, uh, you could see the layer below it now the white section of this top layer, remember, white uh, reveals the layer. So in this case, it's revealing the top layer. So it does. So you're not seeing through to the bottom layer. So hopefully that makes sense to you. Remember, white reveals, black conceals, on a layer mask layer. So hopefully this uh, tutorial gave you a great idea on when you're creating images and you want to show your client or your audience a before and after effect. Remember to subscribe to my channel and click on that bell notification so you always get updated when, you, when I have a new video ready. And also please like, share, and comment. 
Uh, if you have any ideas for future tutorials, just add your comment below and I'll make sure I'll find a way to get it done for you. Thanks again for stopping by. I appreciate you very much. And I uh, look forward to seeing you on the next video. Bye now.